Welcome to Mark Reed 757. Hey, I'm back at you. Uh, today I want to talk about uh, weighing myself. Uh, this is just what I've done personally. I, I tend to weigh myself twice a day, once in the morning and once in the evening. And I've done this for on and off for years. I mean, yeah, there's been stints, especially when I let myself go and gain all the weight back where I don't weigh myself because I could care less. But when I am in the process of uh, caring and wanting to get my health back in order, I weigh my tw myself twice, once in the morning and once in the evening, right before bed. And predominantly, throughout the day, I will have, and sometimes I weigh myself three times, but throughout the day, I will have gained more weight in the evening and then lost the weight in the morning. And it depends on what I eat. Sometimes, you know, if I would eat late, I would actually gain weight by the time the morning came or from the evening. Like, And then if I quit eating at a certain time, then I'll always lose weight. So that's why I've always done intermittent fasting when I get on the health kick and wanting to lose weight and better myself. I always quit around 2 to 4 o'clock. And then I don't eat until 5, 7 in the morning, somewhere around there. But generally it's around 5 to 7 in the morning, and I eat till around 2 o'clock. And I, I've been varying my meals, I and I record how much I weigh each time. And I've been putting my weight in my description, so that way I can go back and look and see where I was. I might not have a picture all the time, but at least I uh, document it. That way I can kind of know. Granted, I'm not sure if the scales are completely calibrated correctly, but I'm just going to go off of that they are. Um, this weighing myself in the morning and evening, it helps keep me accountable. And this isn't for anybody that hates to see any kind of gain. Because if you hate to see any kind of gain, you're not going to be able to continue to do this. You'll get discouraged. And you'll pretty much throw the scale away, don't don't like it, smash it, whatever. But for me, it helps me get an idea that bodies are crazy. Your body jumps in weight, it decreases in weight. And I also realize, you know, you know, I go a lot about how I feel. And I realize that if I don't eat and I lose the weight and then I try to do some activities, I'm going to crash. I'm going to, you know, fall over. I'm just not going to make it. So... There's like a fine line. You got to eat so much and depending what you eat and that'll tell you how well or bad you're doing. Uh, let's see. It, it just totally keeps me focused and that's why I'm going to keep doing that. And in my next video, I'm going to talk about food control and we're going to, you know, just what I've been doing and what's been working for me. Maybe you might pick up something, maybe not. Anyway, have a good one, and I'll talk to you next time.